Dr. G because I'm a professor. I also am a motorcycle enthusiast. Welcome to my channel Harley at 40. In this channel, I'll be sharing with you my motorcycle riding adventures. As a new rider, I learned how to ride motorcycles about um, six months ago in the summer of 2020. And this is my very first bike. This is a Harley Davidson Fat Bob 114. It has Milwaukee 8 engine, 1868cc, and it has 94 horsepower. It's a very powerful and also a very gorgeous bike. I just absolutely love her. As you can tell, I have an accent. I am from Turkey, but I currently reside in this beautiful city of Corpus Christi, Texas in the United States. And I personally hate long speeches, so without further ado, today I'm taking you to a ride on the iconic ocean drive of Corpus Christi, and I'll be sharing with you five facts about Corpus Christi, Texas. See you on the road, let's go. Well, hello everyone. This is the beginning of the iconic ocean drive of Corpus Christi. It's a beautiful sunny Texas Sunday and we're gonna get started. We're going to ride till the end of the ocean drive where we reach at the American Bank Center. And this is your favorite 40 year old <laughs> Harley rider. So to our right, there's the University of Texas A&M University Corpus Christi and Ocean Drive starts to our left. Oh my gosh, there's a road work. I have forgotten about this road work. So as you all know, I'm a new rider. My riding experience is 922 miles and I just get very anxious whenever there are irregularities, you know, road work construction. So we are officially on the Ocean Drive folks, Ocean Drive, iconic Ocean Drive of Corpus Christi, Texas. This construction is a part of the project, Revive the Drive. The last time we had a big construction was in 1970 and these houses here, million dollar houses, they actually had a pretty bumpy road with lots of potholes. And the city of Corpus Christi is changing that right now. In a second, actually, you're going to see the undone, undone, the part of the ocean drive that was not uh, fixed. It's filled with potholes. And this is my favorite ride in the city. Today, I'm going to share with you five facts about Corpus Christi, Texas. This is the ocean drive, iconic ocean drive of Corpus Christi, Texas. Look how beautiful it is, folks. Fact number one, what's in the name, right? Let's talk about the name of the city, where it came from. So it turns out it goes back all the way to 16th century. In 1519, a Spanish explorer discovered this city on the day of Roman Catholic feast day of Corpus Christi and named the city after that Corpus Christi that holy day Corpus Christi what does it even mean it literally literally means the body of Christ look at these houses and hopefully one day I can get into these houses and do a house tour for you these are million dollar hell oh, that was for sale I don't think I can afford it they had pretty bad potholes folks we are heading to fact number two I don't know if you can tell but it is super windy right now Corpus Christi is one of the windiest cities of North America it's so windy that it makes it one of the best destinations for windsurfing sailing kiteboarding and kite flying actually lots of athletes come here to train and we actually had windsurfing world championship in Corpus Christi Texas in 2016 the championship kicked off at the oleander point of the coal park we are about to pass that point oh it's so windy I told you I told you I hope you can hear me there's gonna be some wind noise I apologize 
Okay, now we are officially at the part of the ocean drive that was not fixed. Woo! Potholes, oh my gosh. And there are some really big ones, folks. I am really scared because that can really hurt your motorcycle. Especially for a new rider, potholes are a little challenging. I'm gonna pass this car. It's going pretty slowly. All right, there's another bike car. Moving on to fact number three. Corpus Christi is a home for famous burger joint in Texas, Whataburger. Opened its first location in Corpus Christi in 1950. All right, look at these houses, dude. These are nice houses. They're owned by known celebrities. I'm gonna check to see if I can share that information here. And if I can, I'm actually going to do a Corpus Christi Ocean Drive million dollar house, you know, um, informational video. All right, folks, we're getting super close to the Oleander Point where the windsurfing world championship kicked off in 2016. Here is the Oleander Point at Cole Park. Here we are, we are here. So as you know, I'm from Turkey, but I currently reside in this beautiful city of Corpus Christi, Texas in the United States. It's the best kept secret. All right, now you're seeing the Corpus Christi downtown beautiful day. Here's the cold park coming up. Families are walking, beautiful bikers. I'm saying hi, lots of nice mansions and houses. Another fun fact about me, I traveled to six continents. I've been to six continents except for Antarctica. And I've been to more than 25 countries and hundreds of cities. I hiked to Machu Picchu. I did a bunch of traveling, but never traveled on my bike. As you know, I learned how to ride a motorcycle five months ago. Palm trees, it's a beautiful afternoon. This is First United Methodist Church. I thought it was a Catholic church, doesn't matter. Here is the beach. We have nice beaches in Corpus Christi. I always call it the best kept secret, man. It is to my right. This place is the Water's Edge Park. So folks, we are getting really close to Whataburger. It's going to be to our left. This is the very first Whataburger location ever on this earth. Two-story location that opened in 1950. Fun fact number four about Corpus Christi. Corpus Christi is also the home of legendary pop singer, Mexican-American, beautiful Tejano legend, Selena Quintanilla. Selena Quintanilla was raised in Corpus Christi. She lived in Corpus Christi most of her life. And she actually faced her tragic death in Corpus Christi as well. Pop star Selena Gomez actually gets her name from Selena Quintanilla. So we have Selena's memorial here. Mirador de la Flor. Right here, we're here folks. We are right here at Selena's Memorial. Lots of thousands of people visit Selena's Memorial in Corpus Christi. And March 31st is the anniversary. So I'm actually going to take you to her graveyard. And also I'm going to take you here one day for a detailed tour. I just love her songs. It just makes me really sad because she died very young and I just hate it when beautifully talented people die young. So this is our Corpus Christi Marina. We are going to end up our ocean drive ride at the very end. That's American Bank Center. Okay, so we're heading to American Bank Center. Let me see if I can get into their parking lot because I'm going to take you for an amazing ride. Look at these motorcycles. Woo. Bunch of people. Woo, these are nice bikes. So I don't know if we can enter here, but I'm gonna go in. 
I mean, I'm pretty fearless sometimes in Tunisia. One time, uh, <laughs> I was recording the TSA type of checkpoint, and the security got really upset. Police, so I do those kind of stuff. So, the last fun fact about Corpus Christi is that. We have USS Lexington in Corpus Christi, Texas. As you, I don't know if you can see, but we're gonna get closer in a second. USS Lexington is an aircraft vessel. It was the location they shot the 2000 Pearl Harbor movie, directed by Michael Bay. I think so, it was my company. This is the American Bank Center. We have lots of concerts here. And folks, I'm taking you to the... Let me see if we can go there. Taking you to the barge dock parking. You know what? I guess I can. I see some cars. People are fishing. Let us stay in our lane. All right, punk. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. All right, we made it to the end of the ocean drive. I hope you enjoyed it. So fun fact number five was actually, yes, this is USS Lexington. It's a US Navy military aircraft vessel, right? Okay, I'm gonna stop this. As you can see, we have other bikers. It's a beautiful Sunday here in South Texas. We're in Corpus Christi, Texas. This is actually a great spot I brought you. We had the first rodeo on an aircraft vessel in November 2020 on the ship. We have Texas State Aquarium, South Texas Art Museum. We have our bikers. Say hi. We have the harbor bridge, we have our birdies. Have an amazing Sunday, and I'll see you later. I hope you'll come visit us in South Texas. Have a good day. Stop sign my nemesis bathrooms, my favorite place on earth. <laughs> Don't laugh. I just love bathrooms. It's a beautiful afternoon. Oh my gosh, look at that classic car. It's so beautiful. Oh my gosh. Nice. Well, folks, this is the iconic Harbor Bridge. I am still too scared to ride over this bridge. Hopefully in the future. I am getting back home because it's getting later. So, <laughs> so thank you so much for riding with me today i hope you enjoyed it i would like to thank dj sakpase for providing me with the music and thank you so much for watching this and follow me on instagram subscribe to my channel like and hit that bell button have an amazing week folks bye take care